welcome, welcome, welcome. We are so excited today, bringing you guys some valuable information. I'm Moses Adesimilolu. And I'm LaShawn Adesimilolu. And we are the founders of Rise, Rise Business, Business Solutions. Solutions. And what we do is we help tax entrepreneurs to build, scale, or sell their profitable tax business. <laughs> Guys, we are very excited right now to come through today and we're gonna talk about something that people always wor worry about, starting a tax business, or just starting a business. Definitely. Or just embracing change. Yes. Okay. Guys, when you start a business, it is all about your mindset. You have to, to, it has to be real in your mind before it's going to be real physically. Exactly. Okay, so we're going to talk about three points that help us to basically get into the industry and up level in the industry. Something that we want to share with all of our taxpreneur friends out there, okay? So if you are watching this on YouTube, make sure to like and subscribe, guys. If you need assistance with building your tax business, you can reach us using um, the link in the comments below, and we will be happy to help you. Yes, yes, yes. All right, so the first step, guys, to the mindset that it's going to take to start your own tax business is overcoming the fear. All right, fear is one of those things that holds a lot of people back. It's false evidence appearing real. Yes. All right, I remember when I first got started in the tax industry, I never thought that I was actually going to be in the tax industry. I was working as a personal banker at first, and I was just in a situation where I was just kind of just tired of the nine to five life. I felt like there was a glass ceiling over me. I kept getting passed up for, you know, opportunities to expand. And then I had a, a death in my family. Um, my cousin, who I was very close to, he actually passed away. And it just made me realize, like, you have to, to go for it now. Like, why am I sitting here worrying myself about this job that does not care about me? It's time for me to live my ideal life. And so um, at the recommendation of my husband, who was my boyfriend at the time, I decided to go ahead and get in the tax industry. And when I did, um, a lot of my first fears was, number one, would people really even trust me to do their taxes when I'm just starting out? Number two, am I going to make enough money to actually sustain myself? And number three... I hope I don't mess up anybody's taxes, right? <laughs> and so I just started going after it, guys. I went out there um, with my flyers, passing it out to everybody, leaving it on mailboxes, showing up at the mall and talking to people. And my first year, I ended up getting over 100 clients, and it was like the best year of my life. We were able to travel. I went to Africa. I went to Jamaica. I didn't have to clock into a job. It was one of the best years of my life and so when i tell you guys just push past the fear just do it anyway i'm really telling you that it's going to help you change your life yes guys i could definitely testify to that she overcame her fear of leaving the banking job and going into starting a business head and strong and look at us now we are running this business and we are here telling you that we also help you out if you're trying to run your business so the second point is actually once you get over this fear now you want to reprogram your mind you want to think about the greatness that you are you want to put yourself in positions of greatness you want to always have affirmations you know affirmations really works like a charm you know affirmations really works like a charm what because, are affirmations yeah affirmations first of all is the words that you say to yourself and you are looking to better yourself to grow so when i was when i first came here from africa i i didn't believe that I would be good enough to present myself to the community. You know, first I had a really strong accent. I couldn't really blend in with the culture. And this was the, the hindrance that was holding me back. But I, I, started, I started saying affirmations, started telling myself, I'm good enough. I started telling myself, I'm a king. I started telling myself, I am the one that creates my destiny. I started telling myself these good things. and. 
I see that it helped me out and gave me more confidence. It's making me come out here now and go on a video and let you guys know about my story and about how I feel. Because now I can be out here and have a positive mental attitude to let you know that you could do the same thing. There is nothing in this life that's permanent. So just have a positive mental attitude, have the positive mindset and see the success that you are. Put yourself in positions for success. Put yourself out there. If you're a business, put yourself out there and let people know that this is your business. Feel the success within yourself and watch yourself grow. Absolutely. So those affirmations and reprogramming your mind for success, guys, is absolutely golden. It all starts in the mind first. A lot of us, when we were kids, you know, we were told that we weren't good enough or we saw all of this poverty around us or we didn't have positive business owners to look up to. So we have to train ourselves that yeah. we are good enough. So I definitely can attest to that. Saying affirmations in the morning when I wake up, when I go to sleep at night, all throughout the day, be mindful of those conversations that you have with yourself and lastly guys you definitely want to make sure that you have mentorship all right when we were first starting off in the tax business guys I don't know if you know our story we're gonna definitely do a video on that soon but when we started off with our own business there weren't really any mentors to show you how to build your own business. It was basically like, come be a part of our franchise. We'll take a percentage of your money. And they never even show you how to build your business. It's just like, go get some tax clients and so we can get some money. And so we created this business to help the fellow tax entrepreneur because this is a family business that we have, guys. Our tax firm is a family business. Yep. And so we wanted to create a legacy that we can leave for our children. And so we were not interested in just being part of a franchise. We wanted our own business, our own thing. Okay. And so um, we had to go and seek out business coaches in a lot of different areas to make sure that we were setting ourselves up for success. Um, mindset wise, public speaking wise, um, just just making sure that we have Operational the systems in place. Of the business, yeah, the exactly. systems, you know, because the the systems is like very very important. Yes, yes. The systems is very very important if you in this business. So you know, we we had to go out there and seek the knowledge. The Bible tells you, seek and ye shall find. That's right. We went out there and seek the knowledge, and we have this knowledge now, and that's why we are letting you. Know know that we help taxpreneurs who are looking to build, scale, or sell their profitable tax business because we have this knowledge. Exactly. So, so we do have a mentorship program through Tim, the Taxpreneur Elite Mastermind. The next session is going to open up in about April of 2019. We It's a 90-day boot camp, and then you also have access to the Facebook group, guys. And this is going to help you up-level. We're going to show you about email marketing, branding, how you can outsource and you know get tasks done for pennies on a dollar all about how to build a business that that can really run in your sleep how to build a team how do you make something lasting out of this tax business so definitely if you are interested you can sign up for the wait list using the link in the description below and we will be happy to speak more and tell you more about this wonderful program yes guys we'll be definitely excited to just let those few chosen people who are looking to grow to the next level, who are looking to embrace change for the greatness that they are, go ahead and subscribe and hit that link for the waiting list because we are not looking to take too many people. We only want about 20 people. So it's only, 30, it's only 90 days book camp. We're going to do the first 20, and then after that, you can get into the waiting list. But look, guys, it's going to be a whole lot of valuable information for you, so you don't want to sleep on this. You want to actually take the initiative and be smart about it. Be an entrepreneur mindset, because an entrepreneur is a go-getter. An yes. entrepreneur makes stuff happen. Right. So just to recap on this video, guys, three ways to prepare yourself for entrepreneurship. Number one, overcome your fear. Number two, reprogram your mind for success. And number three, make sure you have fabulous mentors in your corner to keep you up level in every area. We hope you enjoyed this. We will be back next week for another fabulous Rise Talk and Tax Training. And we just hope you guys have a great day. Like and subscribe and we will see you very shortly. Peace out, guys. Thanks for watching and listening. See you later.